We're um, bringing the best truck we own to Mudfest and doing some of our premium fabrication work to it. We're actually going to start doing U kit chops just this quality on 200 series thing. We've got like an array of safety equipment. You don't actually need doors. They actually make it weaker, so you just weld them shut. But this door opens, because there's, oh, that one doesn't, no, this one does. It's actually lighter than carbon fibre, this kind of roof system. As you can see, this is the uh, high clearance and a guards to fit the large tyres. Oh yeah, this is how you make the exhaust louder. You actually cut a V. This is about nine kilo horses. Because it's petrol, it uses fucking heaps of fuel. So if you make the filler neck real short, it gets the fuel into the motor faster. And th this is the key. I got it from South Auckland. You can just like put it in and start it up. There was actually 40 litres of water in the fuel tank. Um, it saves money because it costs so much to run this thing. We've drained about 10 litres of water out of the gearbox and about 20 out of the motor, which was actually sea solid, but a few cans of CRC and now it is the mighty petrol. We're actually going to weld some chain around the engine mount so it stays where it's supposed to. This is actually a new patented battery clamp system that we'll have on our website soon. We've got a variety of hubs on it. That one's actually got a bolt missing, but it's actually a different brand. Possibly the rustiest beadlocks in New Zealand. They're a bit flaky. I think the last guy that worked on this actually died from some form of disease because the seat's really not that hygienic. Really not. This is um to get airflow for the, the passes and you can feel the action that way. This is also carbon fibre. It's not very strong. Put my foot on the clutch and it exploded the hydraulics because that was also seized. The latest in Armac snorkels. It's direct to the airbox, so there's like no restriction. But yeah, this is actually the reason I got into four wheel driving. It's so much more fun destroying something like this than it is to have a nice truck and use it off road because it's just it's so much lighter, it can just go so much further. Steve Sell Customs, um, that does all their decks and stuff, couldn't actually be here today. So um, I've taken over the painting. And we didn't have the spray booth, so we're just using Duke Door Color. Yeah, just fitted the uh, J-Max brake booster upgrade so we can slow down with all this power. So hopefully we'll see you at Mudfest this weekend.